once the information gets into our brain, we need to process it. And the way we process things is through thinking. And in particular, uh, thinking is done and decision making and, and other higher uh, functions are done in the cortex of the brain, specifically the prefrontal cortex of the brain. One of the exhibits that we've developed to get the idea of language across is an exhibit that the visitor interacts with by speaking into a microphone in different languages. My name is Colors, and I'm here to introduce you to the Igbo language. I'll say a phrase, and you'll repeat it. Listen closely to the B sound. Mbwada. Mbwada. This exhibit demonstrates how difficult it is to learn other languages, but it also demonstrates the pathways through which language is incorporated into our brain. We have two kinds of memory, procedural memory and declarative memory. And the declarative memory is the kind of memory that I'm using right now to, to uh, talk about this exhibition. But procedural memory is the kind of memory that you learn, say for instance, learning to ride a bike. We've created an, an exhibit that uh, demonstrates procedural memory. It's a star drawing uh, exercise through a mirror, and it's a typical test that psychologists use to uh, demonstrate procedural memory. Decision making involves uh, planning, and we are one of the few species that, that can uh, plan ahead to uh, make our decisions. This exhibit shows how you can plan ahead and it, in, in a very, very fun way. Uh, this is called the Hanoi Towers, and it's a, a block stacking game. Uh, that requires you to plan your, your moves several steps ahead in order to win. Yeah.